Hello there, Libra. I'm Lex, and welcome to your monthly general reading. If you have not already, please subscribe and hit that notification bell so that you're notified when I post new content or go live. Also, um, if you would like to reach me directly for readings, for coaching, for classes, go to the website and schedule that, as well as visit the shop for any supplies and um, little trinkets that you may need. Uh, one announcement. Um, this month's community working will be a prosperity working, which we will be promoting health, wealth, abundance, um, as well as fertility. So if that is something you're interested in, go to the community tab on my YouTube, sign up for that. And um, the deadline is the 15th of April, April 15th. Absolutely no exceptions. If you don't get in by the 15th, you will have to book a personal and it will definitely not be the same price. So this is a steal as far as the price. This is something that I do every spring and decided to extend it to you guys um, as a, a thank you for your support. All right. So with the cars, I've already pre-shuffled them and drawn them. We will go through in the order in which they came out and then we will rearrange and clarify as necessary. OK, let me get this together. All right. All right, so first up, we have the King of Earth. It's not what I wanted. Here we go. King of Earth, the Empress, Page of Fire, Two of Water, Knight of Fire, and the Lovers paired with the Knight of Earth. Okay, that is together. Crowning the overall energy of your reading, Libra, we have the five of earth and it says fear surrounding money, the wisdom to accept help from others, uncertain self-employment. OK, so is your money a little funny? Is your change a little strange right now, Libra? What is going on here? Okay, Some of you uh, may be in between jobs. Some of you may have had unusual um, situations to hit that may, you know, forced you to tap into some of your savings or your reserve funds okay we're going to clarify this a bit further with our um, angel answer and it says ask your angels for help and unlikely hmm. one more a year from now all right so crazy thing is for you to be as concerned um, by whatever this situation is, things seem to be good. King of Earth with the Empress is lavish abundance, okay? Um, maybe it's just not what you're used to, and I can understand that. You may be used to living a certain way. You may be used to, you know, buying what you want when you want, and now it may just be an issue of budgeting and not overspending right now, okay? Also, this could be related to some of you may be expecting a new member in your family. Um, your love life is taking uh, a, a step in the higher direction, okay? You're, you're going to the next level with your romantic relationship, and that could have you a little concerned with money because, you know, children are expensive, weddings are expensive, people are just damn expensive. It, 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 it just costs just to live and breathe out here, <laughs> Libra, so I do understand that, um, but as it relates to love, I do feel that your love life is getting a stable boost. I feel that it is um, getting that, you know, that movement in the right direction. Um, some of you, it's been a little rough um, the last couple of readings when it comes to romance. But financially, I do feel that you will be okay. Romantically, you seem to be okay. And health wise, everything is looking good. But um, we're going to get some more clarifiers here. <clears throat> Some of you could have had a falling out about money or about children or about spending. And I feel that you've made up over that kiss and makeup. I saw the five of pentacles try to come out. That is that saying that fear and that uncertainty. OK, it may um, serve you well to um, get some tips if you have any friends that are in finance banking, um, estate planning, something like that. I have the seven of swords here, ace of pentacles and the sun. 
so yeah it looks like um you're basically just picking up with where you are and just moving on moving forward and letting the past lie okay what you see these two swords he's leaving behind whatever was in the past because like i said the last few libra readings have been a little intense and you've been struggling a little bit i understand it so i do feel that you're leaving the thoughts the ideas the people the struggles whatever has had you bound mentally and fearful i feel that is coming to an end here okay ace of pentacles that's a new beginning towards a positive outcome all right so what i'm going to do now libra is pull a life purpose oracle message for you and all my oracles are advice for your life purpose oracle message We have teaching. <clears throat> you inspire young people to learn. And we have light and love. Your purpose is to bring divine healing light and love to this world. OK, now some of you could be teachers, um, traditional, like in a classroom. Some of you, you just enjoy a certain passion. And I say this to a lot of people, whatever your passion is, you should be sharing that with the world and particularly young minds, because they are sponges and they're open and they're not going to tell you how you should do something like adults do. <laughs> All right. So for your romance, angel oracles, we're going to get you some love messages. What's going on with Libra in love? Libras in the love department. What is happening here? Because it looks good. Feel good about your romantic life, Libra. Let's see what we got here. We have give your relationship a chance. Work on your partnership. We have worth waiting for. Divine timing is at work in your love life. And we have pay attention to the red flags. The signs are cautioning you. I feel that that has passed, though. We're going to um, go further. I'm going to clarify. Divine timing. In some of the previous Libra readings, it did come up that there was a third party coming in. An earth sign or a fire sign. The Empress has came back up again. OK, so focus on your home life. Focus on your own abundance. Again, like I said, some of you could be expecting. And this is something that you've been wanting for a long time. Um, but here's that the, the money situation. You're worried about how you're going to. Uh, finance it. Some of you are holding back feelings. Some of you feel betrayed because your partner may have stepped out and they may have uh, uh, a baby with someone else or that's you. Okay. You're getting over that. Some of you may have lost a child. King of Wands. King of Wands is very motivated. King of Wands is very charismatic. King of Wands is going to go out there and he don't care who he got to run over to get it done, but he's going to get the job done. And that's what you need to do here with your love life and your relationship, Libra. Everybody got to go. If, if, they're, if they're not yours and they're not the ones that you're taking care of and the ones that you're with, you got to let it go. You got to cut it out. All right. So before we go, I'm going to pull an Archangel Oracle message. Last little tip of advice for you. And then we're going to wrap this reading up. But overall, <clears throat> you don't need to be fearful. I mean, I understand it's just natural to be cautious with spending, but I feel like you're worrying unnecessarily here. Just be smart, not fearful. It's a difference. All right. We have spiritual understanding. I am bringing you esoteric information and symbols and helping you understand spiritual truths. And that is paired with brilliant idea. Yes, your idea is divinely guided. Please take action to bring your idea to fruition. That is that King of Wands energy that I was telling you about. Going for it. Mash the gas. No breaks. All right. Libra, that is your general reading. If this resonates with you, give me a thumbs up, comment, share it with a fellow Libra you feel needs to hear the message. Also, to contact me directly, you can do so through the website. The link is in the description box. And to get in on the Prosperity Community Working, visit the community tab on my YouTube channel and sign up there by April 15th. So until next time, guys, love you. Take care.